What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome into another video. So if you're new here, I'm Jonesy, welcome. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you do like my content, it helps me out. So today we're at my home course. We're going to do an 18 hole course vlog and we're going to try and break the course record. So this is actually going to be a little bit of a quest to break the course record. So the course record here at my home course in Switzerland at Golf Park Morse is 8 under par. Two people were shot 8 under par, one Jordan. I can't say his last name. I'm going to put it on the screen if you can pronounce it. Good job. Uh, and Harry Ellis. So Harry Ellis, um, he's an English professional golfer. Back in 2012, he was the youngest person to win the English amateur. So pretty impressive. Now he's a professional. He's had one win as a professional. Uh, he had the course record here last year in the coronavirus situation. Um, so it's eight under par. Now, I've been close. I've, last week I shot seven under par. I had one under front nine and then I went six under on the back nine. So I've got to get out there. I've got to try and break eight under par. So this is uh, video number one of the quest to break the course record around my home course. Who knows? We might get it done today. Let's go. <laughs> All right, straight into the action. Six iron off the tee here, downwind. Leaves me with 113 meters, 123 yards. It's just a three quarter 50 degree wedge for me. Nice to knock it in there close and roll it in for birdie, so great start. Now I think the key to shooting a course record around this track is to get to at least four under through nine holes. And then uh, you can go four or five under on the back nine. So I've got away to a nice start here, just hitting my approach shot into the second hole. Uh, not the best with a wedge in my hand, leaves me with about 28 feet I think it was. No damage, two putt par, onto the next par five. Got to take a really tight line here if I want to get home in two. And I've just avoided that bush, that left me with 212 meters, 231 yards, three iron just short of the green. So this worked out quite nicely. Pretty simple little straightforward chip. Rolled it up there to about three feet and knocked it in there. Two under through three holes. Fourth hole, six iron, 184 meters, 200 yards. And I've hit it to all of six feet. And guess what? Three under through four holes with a very short par 5 coming up. This is playing into the wind, so I've just gone a low driver. Normally I hit driver sort of 7, 8 iron into this par 5. Today was driver 3 iron. I had 212 yards there into the wind. Had a great shot, great look at eagle. Not to be. Tap in birdie, 4 under. Very good chance here, just Bombs away, driver over the bunker, leaves you with a nice little pitch in here at 83 metres, 90 yards, and I've hit it in there close. At, at this point here, I'm thinking course record is definitely in threat. A nice little fist bump there. That is five under through six. That is a dream start without even having an eagle. So I've got a way to the perfect start. Now these are a couple of hang on holes here, quite a tricky second shot into this green, 180 metres, 196 yards, 7 iron, hit it really good uh, and slid my putt past by about 3 feet. Par is always a good score on the 7th hole there, 8th hole, probably my favourite hole, playing straight into the wind, I pulled this a little bit left of it, actually just clipped the trees, chucked it down just before the bunker. Still playing into the wind, water on the right, pins on the right, left it just short of the green, safe, not in the water. Um, not the worst chip here, but for some reason I managed to lip that part out, so I do make a bogey there, so I slip back to four under par, par three, uh, number nine, 141 meters, 154 yards into the wind. I had a punch 8 iron, just short of the green. Putted from the fringe. 
roll it up there to tap and distance. So that is four under through nine holes. I'm um, obviously away to a dream start. Now we've got the back nine. Um, there's a couple of sort of hang on holes. Ten's quite a strong hole here. I've actually missed it in the bunker. And I hit eight iron out the bunker. You ended up just short of the green. And this was a chip with my 56 degree wedge. Just pulled up a little bit short, but managed to make this part. Made a few really clutch putts in this round of golf, as you as you have to when you're shooting uh, quite a few under par. Good hole, three wood off the tee, perfect position, 101 meters, 110 yards, and I've pulled this onto the bank. Absolutely toast. I've managed to just chip and run it through the rough. So really, really good result there. And once again, rolled it in for a par. So good save. 12th hole, par 364 metres, 179 yards, into the wind off the right. I've hit 8 iron, and that was the wrong club. I needed at least a 7 iron, left me with this 35 footer. That I rolled up there to nice and close, and I've just zoomed in here because I missed it. <laughs> Scratching my head. Just, just pushed it, hit the hole, and pushed it. Um, so back to three under. It's not over yet. There's a couple of par fives coming up that I can get home, and especially because they're downwind. So there's a couple of eagle chances coming up. Um, this was a hundred and. Seven metres out the bunker, three quarter pitching wedge behind the pin. Really good shot. Just didn't capitalise on the on the putting. Par five. Here we go. Fourteen. Downwind. It's bombs away. Just hit it as far as you can. Left me with 180 metres, 196 yards out the rough. I went with seven iron, and it just pulled up a bit short. Not too bad. <laughs> A little bit frustrated with that chip. It wasn't the hardest chip, and I left it probably about eight feet short and missed the putt. So that was a there's a missed opportunity for birdie, also an eagle as well, especially when it's playing downwind. Fifteenth hole, it's driver over the water, 250 carry over the water. Uh, the wind is off the left. Left me with this little pitch shot in here that I've hit a little peach that was from 61 yards rolled it in there birdie so we're back on so we're four under three holes to go this is par five if you can get it down the hill over the corner you can have six iron into this green seven iron unfortunately I left it on the slope so the pin is on the right side of the green and I've got to hit it high off this downhill slope so it wasn't really something I could go for Missed it just short left of the green. Pretty good shot. There's another chip with my 56 degree wedge that run a little bit far past. But I made this one coming back. So that's five under. Two holes to go. 207 metres. 226 yards. Three iron into the wind. That's all I had. I wasn't hitting three wood. And I didn't have my two iron in the bag. Left me with 45 feet. Really good pace putt there. Uh, pace is really key on those long lag putts. Reed wasn't the best, but pace was there, so it was somewhere around the hole. Par on that hole, always a good score. 18th hole, got a mount up and hit a tee shot here. Three wood for me today. And this was 162 metres, 177 yards into the wind, and I thought I flagged it. I just hit a shot through the wind which left me with 35 feet down this hill. I rolled it down there to pretty much tap in. Five under par, not course record, but we're close.